If you're in the ocean, you're probably swimming with a shark. That's according to Nick Whitney, a shark researcher and scientist at the New England Aquarium. And while a certain movie that came out 50 years ago this summer may be partially responsible for a fear of sharks, great whites aren't the only ones in town. And of course, shark spotting humans is really, really rare. You're much more likely to get into a car crash on the way to the beach than you are to be bitten by a shark. So who else is out there? Well, there are over a dozen species of sharks that swim off the Massachusetts coast. Our smallest neighbor is the spiny dogfish. They only grow up to four and a half feet long. The biggest by far are basking sharks and whale sharks. Whale sharks are rarer, but basking sharks summer off the coast of New England and Canada. And despite their big size, they eat the smallest things. Plankton, tiny marine organisms. We even have sharks in Boston Harbor. New England aquarium scientists found a spot just off of Wollaston Beach in Quincy, where they believe sand tiger sharks come to give birth to pups. And along with dogfish and sand tigers, sandbar sharks, dusky sharks, and white sharks are probably the most likely to come close to shore. Overall, there's no need to stress. Sharks are generally uninterested in humans, but here are some shark safety tips in case. Happy swimming.